I gotta hand it to you, Gus. You almost pulled it off. Not sure what you're saying. You know, one thing I can't figure out is... How did you know Garrett would be at the warehouse? No, I definitely don't know what you're saying. We know about the gun, Gus. The Glock 17, you took off Frank Delgado. You traced the ballistics. Hard to make a case without recovering the gun. We can place you at the warehouse at the time of the murder. How did you know he was there? You asking as a cop or a friend? I'm asking. When I heard that animal got released, something just snapped. I gave my life for this job, and it was all a joke. There's no justice anymore. The system is totally broken. So you know what I did? I hit the streets. Just like the old days. I went digging back into that world. Worked some leads, squeezed an old CI, and found out where the meat was happening. If you could take him out during a deal. Bad guys killing bad guys. Mm. CPD's new name for it? Mutual combatants. Mutual combatants. Yeah. I figured the CPD wouldn't look too hard. I had no idea you guys were so close to setting them up. The world's a better place without Matthew Garrett. Don't you agree? I do. But maybe you can look the other way on this. I can't, Gus. Otherwise, Homicide's gonna jam up one of my guys, and he's... I mean, he's a hell of a cop. I was a hell of a cop, Hank. 23 years. When I got blown up for putting a beating on a convicted rapist, I lost my career, I lost my wife, I lost everything. But this scumbag Garrett, a drug pusher, a killer, they put him back on the street. He gets 200 grand and I gotta clip coupons? What the hell happened? You know how this works. Have a little time alone. I want to get a few things in order. Yeah, sure, of course. Thanks, Hank. You were always one of the good ones. I'll be outside. Thank you.